Namaste, hello there. Welcome to my channel, Sappy the Happy Cook. Today we will be cooking a sweet, spicy, tangy dish that celebrates the pineapple, pineapple meniscai. It's an Udpi Mangalorean specialty that is usually enjoyed during festivities and weddings. Let's quickly get started with the recipe. For this dish, we will need half a kg pineapple that I've cut into cubes. I've left the core as it is because it's equally tasty once cooked. Two sprigs of curry leaves, one teaspoon mustard seeds, half a cup of jaggery, half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, salt to taste, three teaspoons coconut oil. Then for the masala, we will need three tablespoons of coriander seeds, one teaspoon cumin seeds, half a teaspoon methi seeds, two tablespoons urad dal, 1.5 teaspoons of sesame seeds or thil, 1.5 tablespoons of chana dal, 1 teaspoon raw rice, 3 tablespoons grated coconut and half an inch piece of tamarind. We will also need 4 Kashmiri chilies and 7 guntru chilies. Now please adjust the chilies based on your spice levels. Now let's move on to dry roasting the spices and the coconut. I'm adding that to my roast pan along with the chilies and I'm going to dry roast them until fragrant. I'm not adding any oil at this point because the coconut has enough oil in it. Once cooled, add it to your mixer jar along with the tamarind and first grind it to a fine powder and then to a smooth paste by adding water little by little. Now let's move on to cooking the main dish. In a pan, I've added 3 teaspoons of oil, add mustard, let it splutter, add the curry leaves and then the pineapple. Saute them for a minute on a medium flame and then add salt, turmeric powder and saute it for a minute again. Add a tablespoon of jaggery, turn the flame to low, saute it, add around 50 ml of water, cover it and cook it for 10 minutes. It's been 10 minutes so let's check. The pineapples look almost cooked. Look at that. So now it's time to add the masala. Also add a cup of water, two teaspoons of salt, mix it really well, cover it and cook it for the next five minutes. After five minutes, your masala should have thickened up like this. Final touches, add in the jaggery, mix it really well, cover it and cook it for just two minutes so that everything is well combined. And in two minutes, your sweet, spicy, tangy pineapple meniscus is ready. Nice thick gravy because of the rice in the curry paste and glossy finish because of the jaggery. So this pineapple season, bring home a ripe juicy pineapple and try this recipe at home. Don't forget to let me know how it was. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please like, share and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Until then, keep safe, be happy.